What's going on everyone? Welcome to EMT. My name's Emad and today we're going to be building my very first PC. Is this going to be an epic fail? Let's find out. Stay tuned. Alright, so let's move the board over very nicely because it is very expensive. And now let's go ahead and unbox the Ryzen 7. Alright, these are the specs of this particular one. I don't know if y'all could see that. Maybe. Yeah, there it goes. So that's that, and this is the actual chip itself. All right, guys, let's do this. All right, now that is completely done. Let's do this. This is the actual uh, chip itself, if y'all can see that. There you go. All right. So that's that. We want to be very gentle with this. All right. So this is the cooler. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else up in here? Nah. Alright, so this is the cooler. That looks pretty cool. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry about that. And uh, moving on. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That's a. Uh, I don't know if y'all can see that. That's pretty cool looking. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Alright. We got two cables on the bottom there. Uh, okay, that's dielectric grease, I guess, or conductive, so I'm not going to be touching that. There's stuff falling apart. All right, so, uh, there's cables in here. Not sure what they're for yet, but we will figure that out. All right, now I don't think we need any of these. So we got these two cables, we'll put them in the cable pile. This is the actual processor itself. And it comes with a sticker, guys! You see the sticker? All right. Yeah, so. Again, uh, try not to touch this. That looks, uh, that really does look like dielectric grease. Uh, that probably is what it is, honestly. Or some kind of a heat grease or whatever it is. All right, so let's unpack this Ryzen, guys. I know the instant I'm gonna open this, it's just gonna go flying out. Hopefully not. Okay, it, it's actually packaged nicely. And we got a sticker, guys. All right. What is this here? Installation, inst who needs instructions? We're men. All right. So with this cool ass sticker in here, we need to be careful not to damage the sticker. That damage the processor, just not the sticker. Oh god! Why am I so nervous doing this? Why am I so nervous doing this? There god, come on! Don't fall out. There we go. Okay, so uh, I've been told to not touch the processor except for the sides of it. So that's pretty much it. This is actually a pretty heavy little thing, man. That's crazy. All right. So now let's bring the motherboard back into the picture here. Uh, I don't know if y'all can see that. Uh, maybe you can. Maybe you can. There's like a tiny, like I don't know why they made it so tiny. But it is literally like, guys, come on. 
it's, the camera is not cooperating, but there's a tiny triangle and you want to match this tiny triangle with another tiny triangle on the motherboard. So this is kind of like a weird little thing here. So all right, this is getting all right. Okay, that felt comfortable. That was like a solid, like a solid thud into the thing. And then after you get it done in there, you just wanna, you'll feel a little bit of resistance. Hopefully that's not it shredding the entire thing. But there we go. The Ryzen 7 is installed into the motherboard. We can go have a beer, not just joking. Uh, yeah, so that's that. Let's move on. All right, guys, so I'm sorry I didn't have the camera rolling. I placed this, the fan that came with it on there. And just trying to see if I can, how this is supposed to work here. So I think it's got these two little clips on the side that are supposed to come in there, but. I don't know why this is so difficult. Bear with me, guys. Remember, this is my first PC build. All right. I think I'm going to need to pry it in there a little bit. All right. Yeah, so that clipped in. That clipped in. Now what I'm thinking is this little thing here is supposed to Gosh, this is putting a lot of stress to it. Okay. Yeah, so that's on there, guys. That was actually really hard. I'm pretty sure this is probably going to be the hardest thing uh, to do. But this looks like it's liquid-cooled and all that stuff. Probably not. I have no idea what I'm talking about again. Uh, so this little cable plugs into this little pin. It's a little four-pin connector there. It's, it has these little grooves on it, so it's very difficult for you to get this wrong. But of course, I will. All right, so that's somehow actually installed in there now. Let me show you guys the clips that I was having a very hard time getting into place. So... This is the fan, and then these clips right here. I don't know if you can see that, but these clips right there were actually really difficult to get on. There's also one on this side, that clip right there. Those are actually really difficult to get on, guys. Um, I don't know if that's by design or maybe it's supposed to be in, but this thing's on there pretty solid now. It's not going anywhere, and hopefully we didn't damage that thermal paste or whatever that stuff is. All right, so uh, 
Let's do the uh, NV Ram stick guide thing. Thank you for watching, guys. I really, really appreciate it. This is just one part of a whole series I'm going to put out about how to build that PC right there get it up and running and everything like that I'm also going to be throwing down a the whole build episode as well from the beginning of the case build all the way up to when we plug it in and get it running remember guys if you like this video like share subscribe it really helps me out if you have any comments or questions or anything comment below let me know what you guys think thank you